welcome back to a new episode on Tahitian County. So, we're going to start up our corn today. We got the uh, 560 out here ready, uh, ready to go. We're going to have the neighbor's kid. He's going to be coming down here and helping us here soon. He's going to drive um, the green cart down there, and he'll probably... He might run combine a little bit. I'm not really sure what the plans are, but I'm just going to have him help me move this first, and we might figure it out and see if he can help us with anything, but... We're going to bring this down to our field. Um... First field we're going to be doing here is going to be field 24, the one that we bought that's new. And then we're going to see if we can't get done 36, 35, and 30 in this episode. I'm not completely sure, though, because, um, I mean, they're, they're smaller fields. They're not like our soybean fields. Our soybean fields are the largest ones out of all of our groups, so that'll be interesting. But we're going to head down to the field. Now we'll be right back with you guys here and uh let's we get to the field. Alrighty y'all, we're pulling into the field here in a second. Let's see if I can't take a right here. Hopefully we can fit this all in here. There we go. So we got that in here. We got the guy behind us following. Let's see if he can make it in here. Oh no. And he did. That that was that was insanely close. I don't want to see that again. Cheesy beats. Now let's lower down here. We're gonna get out and attach to PTO and all that good stuff. I should have did that at the farm. Got the hydraulics and the uh, PTO connected here really quick. And we gotta unfold this. All these Things. This is a, this is an older head, obviously, so it still does all this. It's an 843. But we're gonna start harvesting this field. Let's actually uh, here. Let me get inside this really quick. Um, we're gonna take a little dive into it. Let's see how good it is first. Let's get lined up. I don't want to start at an angle. Won't really benefit us that much. Here we go. Yeah, there's some of the down corn that we have had from uh, when we did in Hydrus. We're going way too fast. You kick her down to like three. It's still pretty fast. So we're getting over 200 bushels an acre. Monitor's reading 210 right now. And it's going up, so. We're about to figure out what we're going to get on this field. I don't think we're going to get anything too special since we didn't lime it or do anything special to it except putting hydras down. Yeah, see, we're sitting at 213 right now. But I'm going to start a time lapse up. So you guys could just sit back, relax, and enjoy while we uh, do this field. I'll probably be back with you guys once we, um get like a full load or something like that and then uh i can tell you guys how it went but it's I mean the ride seems smooth so far on corn because we haven't really changed it i mean i had to change everything the shed last night in the corn mode and stuff because it was on soybeans so i had to change all that um change some new stuff on the gps so we got that all set up so i'll probably set up a gps um line here but i'll have to it might take me a little bit since we haven't set one up for this field yet but just sit back, relax, and enjoy while we uh, get this corn harvested here. y'all we're pulling up to the combine here 
We're just gonna unload her. Uh, we got her filled up a little bit ago, so I had to run back and get the grain cart. The uh, neighbor's kid had to go back home and do some stuff, chores, I'm assuming. But I told him he could go uh, do that. I mean, I didn't really care that much, uh, as far as I'm aware. But, um, we're gonna get this unloaded, then I gotta move out of the way because, well, I can't really move it over here, so I'll probably move this down over to there. Uh, actually, no, I'm gonna back this up so I can have room to turn over there. But it's this this field's yielding around 218 uh, bushels an acre. Let's get in the cab and check. But yeah, 218.5. So that's what our monitor's saying here. I'm not sure if it's completely correct. I'm assuming it's probably not like accurate, accurate, but I'm sure it's uh, pretty good. So we're probably gonna get quite a bit of corn from this field. Hopefully, at least. Um. We haven't really used GPS, but we gotta do three headlands around, and then we're gonna start up and our up and down rows. And yeah, so I'm gonna probably get back to the time lapse scene in a second. I'm just gonna back this tractor up, get her out of our way, of course. And we're gonna get back to the time lapse.
Alrighty, y'all. So we just finished up on our uh, first cornfield here. Actually, no, we're not done yet. I just realized that we still have the cow out here. So I'll actually finish that with you guys here. But we're almost done. Um, we're going to start up on our next field. I'm probably going to actually transfer all the equipment off camera. I'm going to go dump everything. Well, yeah, I'm going to go dump the semi and the um, gravity wagon off camera because I mean, nothing to it. Just bringing it down the fence. Um, we'll probably start on um, the two small fields over there, and I'll probably time lapse those too, so we can get those done. Let's move this tractor out of the way. I gotta get in here. I didn't realize. I thought I'd, it was done. It's weird. Hopefully, we don't fill the cart. It's not fill the cart. It's awfully close. I wonder if I'll be able to fit everything in there. Oh, we're about to find out. Um, make sure if you guys do like what you're seeing here, you know, you leave a comment, like, and subscribe. I've been having a lot of fun making these videos, so I appreciate it a lot. It means a lot to me. Nope, we can't even fit that much into it. So the next field, I guess I'll dump the rest of this into there. Well, let's bring this to the next field, and I'll move all the other equipment off camera, and we'll start the uh, next f harvest on the next field. See you guys then. Alrighty, so we're bringing our um, auger cart down here. We just got done um, getting everything filled up down at the farm over there. So we're bringing the auger cart down. Um... We're going to have to make an entrance into the field because we don't have anywhere to put um, our tractors and stuff in the field yet. So we're going to have to leave this in the middle of the road here for a little bit. I mean, no cars will really come down here anyway, so we should be fine. But not really ideal. Shut that. Oh, we got to get another combine here. Oh, forgot to start her up a little bit ago. Get in here. Turn her fire up. Set the cruise to about three. Low three. We'll just make a little area over here so that we can get in with our equipment. Yeah, we got all the down corn from when we uh, came and did in hydros over here. It's not really that good. 219 bushels an acre right now. That's what I'm reading at least. So about the same as the last field we did. Back this up. I'm gonna make another path up in here. I don't. Okay, that should probably be good. We'll probably keep going around like this. So I'm going to get everything into the field, and then I'm going to start the time lapse, so we're probably going to get these two fields done since they're right next to each other, so just like, sit back.
Alrighty, everybody. So we just got done with the um, second field here. I think that's going to end it for today's video. Um, I think we're going to try and get the other one be done either on a stream or possibly um, in next video. It all depends on how I uh, plan it out. But hope you guys all enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next one.